Hi guys, how are you? Today we're gonna learn a new song. It's called Tiptoe Boo. And the first thing I need you to do is to get your music ready in front of you. I do have mine. All right, we're gonna have a look to the music. And the first thing I need you to do is to watch the whole song and go at the bottom because we have three different dots with three different colors. One is blue, one is red, and the other one is black. Who remember what does it mean? Exactly. Those are the different colors for the different strings we have to use today. If you look at your music, you'll see some notes on blue, some notes are black, and some notes are red. What does it mean? What means the red color? Who remember? E string. That means all of these fingers go on the E string. What the blue color means? It means that these notes go on the D string. And what happens with the black color? Exactly. All those notes go on the A string. The next thing I needed to have a look is the rhythm. Which kind of rhythm shapes do we use in tiptoe boo? Do we have crotchets? Do we have quavers? Do we have minims? Are those tas, tahas, titi, shh? What do we have there? Hmm. Exactly, we have all tas. We have all crotchets. And what else do we have? We have another symbol and I made a green circle around it. What's the name? How do we call it? It's this one. It's a shush, it's a rest. Okay, so we can't forget it. Well, let's go back to the music again and we are going to read together the first line. Are you ready? Ready, go. D, one, D, one, D, one, A, sh, D, one, D, one, D, one, A, sh. Are they all ta? Yes, they are. And do we have some shush in the middle? Yes, we do. So when we play it, we have to respect the shush. And we're gonna make a tiny balloon in every single one. We're gonna put our violin hand up and we're gonna move the fingers as this, at the same time we say the rhythm. Are we ready? One, two, ready, go. D, one, D, one, D, one. A, sh, D, one, D, one, D, one, A, sh, well done. The next thing we're gonna check in our music sheet is what strings we have to use. If we have a look to the music, what are the colors do we have on the first line? We have blue color and also black color. This means that we need to use the D string and also the A string. I'm going to play it once really slow for you guys. Just listen. I take that my thumb is in the office, my fingers are awake, my bow hold is really beautiful right now. I have all of my fingers wrapping the bow and the pinky is on top and my thumb is bumpy. It's not Mr. Banana, remember? It's Mr. Bump. Place your bow on the D string and listen. D, one, D, one, D, one, tilt to A, balloon. Balloon. Hi 
guys, Steve the giraffe is here with me and is gonna help me to keep my wrist straight. I know Steve the giraffe is not with you at home, but you can imagine that it is and is hugging your wrist to help you to remember to keep it straight without squeezing its head, okay? So I'm gonna put it in the proper place. That's it. Hi guys. One, two, ready, go. D, one, D, one, D, one, A, balloon. D, one, D, one, D, one, A, balloon. Good job. Okay guys, let's go now for the second line and we're going to have a look first as we did before and we're going to see which one are the colors we have in there to tell what's the string we have to use. A blue color and black color again, that means we still use the same strings, D and A. Put your violin hand up and let's read it with the fingers, ready? One. Two, ready, go. D, one, D, one, D, one, D, sh, A, 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 D, sh. It's a little bit different than the first line, okay? Be careful, watch up your music, and don't make mistakes. Let's play it with stops, okay? Are you ready in your resting position? Remember Steve the giraffe still with us? We're gonna play it together really slow. Zip and step, stop the traffic on your head, on your shoulders. The beginning of the second line, still blue color. That means we have to keep our bow on the D string. Remember your wrist, careful with Steve the giraffe's head. <laughs> ready, super slow. One, two, ready, go. D, one, D, one, D, one, D. Balloon. You can pause the video and play it a few times in a row to make it perfect. Let's carry on. We tilt to the A string because the next note we have is black color. How many A's do we have in a row? Can you count them? Four, well done. And after these four, we go back to the D string. Are we ready together? One, two, ready, go. One, two, three, four. Back to the D string, ready, go. And a huge balloon. This is the moment when you pause the video and you practice this little part again. Okay guys, you have been practicing the second line. Let's put it all together. Ready? Without any stop. Second line, place your bow on the D string. One, two, three, go. D, one, D, one, D, one, D. Balloon. A, two, three, back to D. Huge balloon. Well done. together. Zip, step, stop the traffic on your head, on your shoulder, chin on the chin rest, pointing to your side, your bow on the D string. We go from the beginning. Ready? One, two, ready, go.
have a look to the music and tell me which one are the colors you have on the line number three and line number four. Exactly, there are no blue notes, right? So we don't have to use the D string on those two lines. We have black color, that means fingers on the A string, well done. And we also have red color, which means fingers on the E string, fantastic. So put your violin hand up and let's read the third line all together, moving your fingers. Are you ready? One, two, ready, go. A, one, A, one, A, one, E, sh, A, one, A, one, A, one, E, sh. Okay, are you ready to play it? Be careful with the shush and we be careful with the tilt from the A string to the E string. We need to move the elbow down, remember? Feet together, zip, step, stop the traffic on your head, on your shoulder, chin on the chin rest. Remember your bow hold, take that all your fingers are around the bow and the pinky is on top and your thumb is bumpy at the bottom. Eyes on the music, let's play together with stops. Are you ready? Bows on the A string, one, two, ready, go. A, one, A, one, A, one, stop. We go to the E string, drop your elbow, ready, go. And balloon because we have a shush. We play the bow, we place the bow on the A string again. You ready? Off we go. A, one, A, one, A, one. Stop again. We tilt to the E, ready, go. And balloon. This is the time you stop your video and practice the whole line with the stops three times in a row. All right, have you been practicing it with stops? Fantastic. I think we are ready to play the whole third line without any stop together. Are you ready? One, two, three, A. to jump to the fourth line. We have a look, we put our violin hand up and we're gonna read it together, moving the fingers again. Ready? One, two, ready, go. A, one, A, one, A, one, A, sh, E, 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 A. How many E's in a row do we have at the end? Let's count them. Four, exactly. Four E's and one A at the end with a huge balloon by the end of the line. Let's play it together. Are you ready? One, two, three, go. Place the bow on the E string and we repeat the E four times in a row. Go! One, two, three, four, stop! Tilt your bow to the A and we're gonna play one A. Ready? Go! Huge balloon. Now it's time to pause your video, practice it again with the stops, and I'll see you later. Alright guys, 
Have you finished your practice with stops? Are you ready to play the whole fourth line in a row without any stop? Concentrate. Eyes on the music, fingers on the stickers, your bow on the A string, your bow hold properly and beautiful. Careful with your wrist. Remember, stiff the giraffe's head. One, two, ready, go. Oh, one. carefully to the music and I need you to tell me if this sound familiar if the two last lines we have sound familiar for you have a look hmm yeah they are exactly the same than the beginning so that means we just need to play the two first lines again it's like a sandwich we have the bread then we put the cheese and we close the sandwich with another bread slice. So, are you ready to play the two last lines in a row with the stops? With me? Really? Let's go for it. Fit together, zip, step, stop the traffic on your head, on your shoulder. Remember not on your chest, pointing to the front, on the shoulder, pointing to your side bow hold on the D string because the first note is blue color careful with your bow hold, pinky on top, your thumb bumpy underneath your fingers ready to go on the stickers, your wrist straight remember Steve the giraffe's head or Toffee the lion, whoever you prefer and let's go to play the last two lines together without the stops eyes on the music, ready, off we go Last line. 